So here we have a Lennox Pulse Furnace. Just wanted to show you what it sounds like when you light it with the uh, front cover guard off. I think actually you need that cover on there because this needs to force fresh air through the combustion chamber. So you have to light it with the cover on, I think. Okay, so I got it running. I put this back on and held the metal cover over so that it could actually mix with that gas. Let's take this off of here and then you'll be able to hear how loud it is. This is not spinning anymore. This buffer tube right here protects uh, the gas valve from the in and out of the uh, gas. Free purge combustion blower. It's just too loud for me to explain while this is going. But let me just explain real quick. So, furnace gets call for heat. The control turns on the uh, main blower to just run some air and it turns on this pre-purge blower. This pre-purge blower pushes fresh air into this uh, intake box and then through the entire heat exchanger and that main combustion chamber thing which is back in there. Um, and then the control brings on the igniter and then opens the gas valve. The gas valve lets gas in through this line which goes up <clears throat> into the combustion chamber. They mix, they ignite with an explosion. That explosive force closes this valve. So this is like a check valve. When that first whoomph explodes inside there, it closes off this valve which creates pressure pushing out this way through the exhaust and then outside ultimately. But that explosion that pushes the exhaust out also then creates a slightly negative pressure which allows the check valve to take air in and then the gas mixes with the air to make another uh, good mixture that it ignites and explodes so it just does it over and over again kaboom intake boom intake boom intake boom and that's what we get that sound from so we could light it up again here Main blower, little blower, and we gotta, in order for it to pre-purge properly, we gotta hold this on there so that it can actually get air pushed through the heat exchanger. Not sure if this is like a 30 second pre-purge or what it is. Okay, just clicked off the main blower. There's the igniter, and the gas valve opened, and now it's lit again so we can take this back off of here. So if you feel right here, it feels like a really loud speaker, because that's vibrating so much, it's actually a lot like a loudspeaker, a lot like a horn. This, this doesn't get hot unless this thing is turned off. And I'm not really scared to touch this because this just mixes the air because our gas is entering over there. Really a neat furnace, especially while it's running. And then notice again, this is turned off because that's just a pre-purge blower. It does not actually uh, need to run while this thing is exploding because that pressure just pushes all the exhaust gases out. Very noisy furnace. Anyway, I gotta put it back together, but it's working now, so I'm happy. I had to replace this uh, pre purge motor. Last thing worth mentioning is listen to how loud it is now that everything's put back together. You can just barely hear it. It's amazing. Most of the noise actually comes from this buffer tube. 
open the system is running. I mean, it's running just like just like it was before. But now that we got this cover bolted back on here, we're good to go. I think that maybe why they build these covers so heavy duty is just so that it can't rattle. I mean, if it was made out of any thinner gauge material, then that vibration of that thing going all the time would definitely make its way through and be super annoying. So, really thick quarter inch steel plates welded together, bolted on with a nice thick gasket, and then really thick insulation to absorb the noise. And Lennox did a nice job. They're, they're really a neat furnace. They're just old, but very impressive how long they seem to go. <laughs> Good job, Linux. You made a product that works for a long time.